Never knew that it could feel this way when you lie next to someone. You don't even need to play pretend, cause you find the way you are. Hey guys, and welcome back. I know Easter's already passed, that was yesterday, but I hope you guys had a blessed day. I hope you got to spend it with family or friends, or at least you felt loved, most of all. But I was just going to let you guys hang out with us and celebrate with us. We didn't have a big crowd over on the stage just because we don't want to have a ton of people around the baby. So it was just us, all of my kids, and then my mom and Kaylin came, my sister. So we had a good time. We had an adult Easter egg hunt. So everybody had an egg to find and one was golden, but they didn't know if the golden egg was worth more than the smaller eggs because we had money in them we had different things so they had so much fun they're all so competitive and it's fun to see the kid in them come out because they're you know half grown most of my kids are grown but allison is half grown and it's just fun to see your adult kids laugh and just be a kid so anyway hang out with us we're gonna cook we're gonna clean we're gonna find some easter eggs and see what they got and it is so much fun so i'm so glad you're here and to the lady that told me to tap the eggs on the big end with a spoon and the eggshell will come off easier, you have made my life so much more simple. We do pickled eggs all of the time, so we're all the time peeling eggs. So if you'll email me, I'll put my email up on the screen. And if you'll email me, I'm going to send you a gift card. I could stay forever when I'm lying in. a sloth pooper for Easter. Let's see what it does, Kennedy. You wind it up. Can you do it? <laughs> Sticks in the mud. You have the time of your life every single night. The confetti's raining down. You put your hands to the sky, center of the crowd. You're the talk of the town. bought two cartons of 18 each and then we bought a box of 60 eggs so i made deviled eggs of course with some just for our easter dinner and tell me how you like your deviled eggs i like mine more mustard and vinegary than mayonnaise heather likes hers more mayonnaise i offered to make her some with more mayonnaise in it and she was like no i just eat the white anyways but anyway let me know how you guys like your eggs i just like the vinegar the mustard taste so that's how my family makes it let me know how yours does but we were going to make some pickled eggs and half of them i use some beet juice just because i love pickled eggs and beet juice and then the rest we just made with vinegar water and sugar so how i do that my dad uses one third vinegar two thirds water and like a teaspoon full of sugar I use two thirds vinegar, one third water, and a teaspoon of sugar. Just because my kids love them like really, really pickled and sour. So anyway, somebody had asked me how I made those and I did use like half and half, but then my kids wanted them even stronger. So I think that's the trick for us and I know everybody's got different tastes and all that, but I guess my number one is beet juice for sure. And then I just like them pickled as well. I wanna be the life of the party. I wanna hold on to somebody. Be cool. Be cool. I wanna be the life of the party. I wanna dance with somebody. Whoever subscribed or told us about this, thank you. I know. Thank you, thank you. 
so much easier. It rolls down one off. I know, that's like, you just can't tap it too hard. Yeah. I think it puts a tiny little crack in it and it lets water get in between the shell and the egg, which makes it slip off. Morning has broken, my windows are open. Wanna feel the wind blow through my hair. Which way do I follow? What happens tomorrow? I turn to you and hope you can guide the way. Sometimes I give up, just wanna be on my own. Even in the darkest times, you give me. My mom opened the refrigerator to get something to drink and she said, oh my gosh, how many pickled eggs do you have? And I was like, mom, this won't last me, Heather, and the kids a week. Like seriously, we can wear these out when we have them. An egg is protein, so you can't be eating a hard boiled egg and that's pretty much the only way I will eat an egg. I don't like scrambled eggs or fried eggs or anything like that. I can eat an egg sandwich, but that's it other than that. But like I said, we started out with 96 eggs and Allison colored 12 and then we used 12 for deviled eggs when we did break. So that one went in the trash, but the rest were pickled. So we have some eggs up in here for sure. So moving along to some of the cleaning part, Heather has all of the cat stuff over here. So this is where they eat and they make a mess all over the wall. I don't know how, but they do. So I was going to scrub the wall down. When we painted this kitchen nook area, we used cheap paint. Like we bought it at Ollie's. I think it was like Black and Decker brand. I mean, it was a brand I had never even like heard of or didn't even think that they made paint. But this paint's terrible. You can like scratch it off with your fingernail so obviously when I took a brush to the wall the paint started coming off and I was like well we need to paint this anyway so I'm just gonna go ahead and get some of this off and then I was like no I don't need to get into all that right before everybody comes over so I just kind of left that but I am gonna paint over here so let me know what color you guys think I should use because if it's up to me I'll use gray or black <laughs> so I do like it just white but I'm going to be in the same shape. I mean, I know I can buy better paint, and I will, of course, to paint this just so it's washable. But let me know, should I just paint it white, or should I paint it a different color, or maybe a different color on bottom, and then a different color on top, like maybe half and half, and put some border up, some kind of a trim up. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. It's kind of a weird area. It's very pretty, and I love it, but it's just kind of awkward, you know, to do something with.
my brother's hanging out one night with him and she sent me a picture of this table and she was like your brother wants to know if you want this so I thought by the picture that it was a small round end table but it ended up when I got home it was a big kitchen table so I think I'm gonna put that on our back screened in porch I think maybe get a couple chairs and at least that would be a place to eat while we're out there so I think that's what I might do with that just gotten out of the shower and she was showing me what she got from some of the softball parents at ETSU where she plays ball. Some of the parents had threw a bag together for each of the girls so that was super sweet and they had a little easter egg hunt out in the outfield so they had a lot of fun and I love that they do things like that for the girls. It just makes me think that they do care about them. It's not just a number to them or a player to them. They do care about them. So Anyway, I'm just trying to get this kitchen picked up and get these floors clean. And you'll see in a few minutes that I move along to the bathroom and I get that cleaned. Then I started on macaroni and cheese and the mashed potatoes, things like that. And then like C got here like an hour early with my baby. So of course I had to stop and hold her and love on her. But I did take their Easter pictures. I'm going to include some of that so you guys will see that. I'm not going to read my devotional today just because we have an Easter egg hunt at the end and I leave all of that in, but my mouth is loud. So if I am annoying to you, you probably won't want to watch it. But anyway, I just wanted to let you guys know why there wasn't a devotional, but I'm so thankful that he's alive. He's living and he's everything we need. If I could only be the less something in my brain causes this stress. So come and make me feel different mm -hmm. You wanna hold, don't hold back No, oh, your little drama's got me mad And I don't need to tell you facts You know I always want you back
song you sing As you wake up my soul today I feel the hope when your sun shines on my face Oh, I wake up with your grace While the moonlight still fading away I see your mercy coming with the day Oh You cannot open them. On your mark. Get set. Go. You all think I'm that obvious. I mean, if she still, if she finds a gold neck, she can exchange it right now. She can put hers down and get it. But, unless somebody else finds it first. There's, they're not in a car. Only one's been found. We did pretty good. I'm gonna have to give y'all hints. I can't believe that only on one's porch? been found. Is there any on the porch? I ain't telling y'all nothing. Okay, well tell me that much. Are we going to give them a hint? What's even at the woods? Oh, it's not back there. Wait, do we get a hint? So, it, like, is it in the yard? Kennedy Payne! Somebody done looked in there, missed it twice. Allie looked in the trash can twice. You're kidding me. Oh That's two. Hey, it may not be worth nothing. You don't know. Okay, I'll give y'all a hint. <laughs> there's none on the back porch. And there's none on that side of the house. It's from the front porch this way. Okay? That's your first clue. on the roof in plain view and nobody's seen it. Okay, we're going to have to give some more hints. Three's been found. There's four more. Are they under course? Hunter, if one had been a snake, it would have bit you. It is. Well, Allie, you've already found one. Allie. It's not. Kennedy already found that one. No, but it don't matter. It's 
So is that one Lexi's or Hunter's? No, that's Hunter's. <laughs> She's like, that's Hunter's. <laughs> okay, is there any more up here? There's one more in the front yard. Front yard? Mm hmm In there? Is it not past the house? Nope, it's from here over in the front. Hunter gonna get snake bit. I literally looked right at that yellow ball and thought it was an egg earlier. I seen that softball. Hunter, you're hot. But you already found one. Lexi, Hunter's hot. What? No, no, no. You already found one, Kaylin. Kaylin, no. You already found one. Nope, Lexi has to find it. Did you see what he did? He ran over that water meter. So is it in here? Huh? It was, you were hot. You were like burning up. Me? Mm -hmm. Okay, go back over there. You were burning up. Hey, did you all find one, Reagan? So there's just two left. They're all on the front. in the front. Hunter's hot. No, it's not in a car, I promise. You're hot. Lexi's so hot. So hot. Don't hit your head. Reagan, his is this way. Hot, you're hot. Y'all are hot. Hot, hot. Hunter, you're hot. Hot, hot, hot. We know we jump in your car. Where at? Give us a give us a name. He ain't gonna see how those sunglasses on. Give me my egg. Reagan, you're hot. Hunter's hot, hot, hot. Oh my Hunter, it's in plain sight. I just seen it. I swear. I don't know where the heck it is. <laughs> I don't see it. This is such a romantic date. This is your Easter picture. Mimi, it's not in plain sight. Yes, it is. You can see it. Where you? ain't found theirs yet. Yeah, I see it. I see it. Move. Move. <laughs> no, 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 no. You gotta let him do it. I told him I was gonna get him. It was not plain sight. It. You can see it. You gotta dig for it. You gotta dig for it. They said probably. Okay. Okay, everybody go in. Everybody go in. Hunter said it's not there. It was right there. Mom said it was taken by your back. Hey, what do we get? Rate us on one to ten. Hot next. That was we did pretty good. You did do pretty good, but that was too close. Wait, hold up. Where did you find yours? In the porch for yours? Mine was under a tree. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you're in the wrong cut. Yeah, mine was the Hers was up in the bumper on the inside. They had to crawl up under it. it still Hunter didn't was right there. Still didn't you couldn't see it from right when Kayla grabbed it. I couldn't see it. <laughs> I had a, they were just too blind to see it. Okay, the prize egg was in a trash bag in the trash can. Mm -hmm. they the that trash. was the worst one. Like, yeah, I'm sorry. That was I figured that was going to go with a dirty diaper. Well, it was like that bag's almost gonna be in there, so I, it was still open. I was like, "Yeah, where'd you find yours, Reagan?" Right mm -hmm. Yours was on the roof. On the roof? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ella, you put your hand in. Yes. Give her back to do. Okay, so are you gonna try? Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us on this Easter Sunday and I hope that it was a blessing to you. I hope that you feel loved here and I hope that it's a safe place for everyone. You are not just a number to me and I hope that you feel like you're part of us. I hope when you watch things like this that you're sitting in the living room with us. You're sitting there eating with us. But thank you guys so much for being here. I love you. Jesus loves you. He loves you so much and I'll see you guys in the next one. Shows through the darkness The fire burning in the night Be a hope for the world so broken Be a front to the lonely The joy that he showed me Oh, I didn't even do it like that <laughs> 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 Oh, I didn't even do it like that
out of all this. The little flying chicken. <laughs> Kennedy. <laughs> they think it's so funny. Where'd it go? <laughs> Now, how y'all gonna get the chickens off the ceiling? Where do I go? Losing hope, yeah, I know. It's hard. I wanna be a shining light. Live a life that shows through the 